this is one of my labs that monitors water quality. Any nasty stuff gets in, it tells you. I wanted to check on it myself, but there's just never enough time. Feels like Harry's not telling me something. I hope he's okay. Hey, Pete. In the mood for some good news? Sure. I've already got plenty of the other kind. I just posted a new article. Oscorp announced Harry's research stations are providing valuable data, so they're fully funding them. You're kidding. That's great. I just wish we could tell Harry. He hasn't returned my calls, which is weird. I know how important this is to him. Norman bids his son farewell. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait. Norman sent Harry away... For treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? So close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. I will. I love you, son. <laughs> 